So I'm here with Daisy. So what character do you play? I play Susan, the older sister. OK, so what, um, what's Susan like? Well, she's, uh, she's quite a sort of a calm, um, collected character. Um, she's also quite a worrier. She's the mother of the group, so she's um, the one that, that feels probably um, the most responsible for everybody and making sure everyone's OK. She's, she's OK. Quite, yeah. <laughs> OK, so um, what is it like working with um, the other characters as being, them being your siblings? Is it easy to kind of mother over them? It is actually, it's got very easy. It was a bit difficult at first, but now the four of us seem to have kind of slipped into our roles out off, off stage as well. Um, I, I tend to sort of be telling everyone to get lots of sleep and, and you know, um, keeping people in order sometimes. And, and um, the others, you know, they fall around. And we all mess around like siblings now. It's quite funny how we've all sort of connected in, in that way. That's great. So I know you're only 19, same age as me actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I say only, but yeah, same age as me. Um, how long have you been acting for? Well, um, I went to Winstone's school um, and there we, we did acting all the way from class, well, from the, the age of eight, eight or nine. Every year we did something. But I really, I started to love acting um, about the age of 15, 15, 16 where I played, um, in the Threepenny Opera, I played Lodive Jenny. Um, she's like a big, sort of, um, big, feisty character. Um, and, uh, and singing and acting, and it was, it was perfect. I loved it. And um, that's when I really started to love, I love being on stage and love to be in a character. Um, uh, and, and since then, I've done a couple others that I've really enjoyed. Um, so not long. I haven't been. It hasn't sort of. I haven't grown up with it, but um, yeah, it comes quite naturally to me. But from what you said, it seems like you've got a lot of experience under your belt. Yeah, quite a bit. Yeah, um, more when I got older. I, I got bigger parts when I was older, um, and uh, but yes, I, it didn't really. I didn't take to it when I was when I was little, but I have done recently. Yeah. Okay, so um, in respect to maybe um, your career, is this something you're definitely looking to make a career? Definitely. Yeah, I've been thinking of it for a couple of years now to go to a drama school. Um, maybe, maybe in a couple of years' time, actually, uh, when I've done some work and I, I want to, to travel a little bit and not settle down too quickly. Um, but yes, it's definitely something. If, if, I, if I go to university or anything of the sorts, so I would probably do acting, yeah. So if I see you in 10 years, where do you hope to be a West End? Gosh, I don't know if it's that, if it's that um, decided for me. It, it's not where, it's, it's sort of if I'm enjoying what I'm doing, you know. I mean, I'd love to be, I'd love to be doing drama of sorts. I mean, I could be te teaching or uh, just doing, you know, smaller productions. It might not even be my, my only job but as long as I'm doing it I think I'd be happy you know it's not it's not my goal to be on the West End in the West End you know on the big stage it, I mean it would be great but I know that that's also it's difficult and um, I suppose I'm a, I'm a bit more realistic. <laughs> <laughs> well saying that a lot of hard work determination always equals success um, so how did you actually find out about this particular production? Oh well I mean uh, I'm friends with Alexander Gifford um, and Adrian, and um, and they just they approached me when they were deciding to do this, and they they said we've got a part for you, and would you like to do it? And I said definitely, um, and you know they had to make sure I was around at the right time, and I could I could put enough time aside for it because it's it's full on, especially especially in November, and then all the way through December we'll be doing performances. Um, but uh, I know everyone in the cast, actually, so we're all pretty connected in some way. That's great. So I know you're running until next year, the production. Yes. So the nerves kicking in, yeah? Not really. No, I, I don't really get nervous. Just um, in your own little element when yeah, you're on stage. I'm just loving it. I just love it. And um, every day it's, it's, it feels better. Every day it feels more settled. It's, it, it seems, you know... It seems like the right thing, and, and every you know every day it, it feels like I'm I'm more Susan than I was the day before, um, 
and that's what I love. I mean, I don't think I'll get too nervous, um, maybe just, just before a performance, but um, I don't really. I'm used to performing. Um, I mean, I'm in, a, I'm in a singing trio as well, and we're doing a lot of performing and um, national competitions and stuff. So, so yeah. busy, busy, busy. Very busy. A lot of performing. A lot of stage. <laughs> OK, well, I wish you luck. I hope it all goes well. I'm sure you'll be brilliant. And I will be an audience watcher. Brilliant. Thank you. Thank you very much.